Yes, sir. All right, man. It looked it looked bleak right right late in that fourth quarter. It they did. got that first, they got those first uh, that first down, and, you know, and then you guys somehow forced to fumble. Just talk about that second half. You know, they got they got up early in the first half, in the first quarter, fourteen nine. But how did you guys just stay poised? Yeah, I knew my I knew we uh, went down 14, 14 or seven going in this going in the second half. But uh, we had some mishaps on defense, and I knew my boys got my back. I ended up scoring um, in the first half, and my boys got my back. In the second half, we just grinded, made some few changes on defense, grinded through the second half, ended up getting the ball back, two minutes left in the fourth quarter, and we grinded down the field and scored again. How were you guys just able to stop their offense, especially their running game? You know, they got the, you, Early, they got those runs, but how did you guys able to stop them from getting those big plays that they normally get all the time? Right. Coach Dugan set us up for uh, great success going into that run game. Going into the second half, uh, as you can see, we uh, stayed humble and pushed down the field and stopped them, at, stopped their run game, which is their most strongest point of the of their offense. So it was amazing. Last year it went into overtime. Right, same, this same year, thing. This year, double overtime. Just tell you, you know how crazy is it? Just you know, these types of games against your rival. Right, uh, man, it's just crazy the atmosphere. I mean, our Fenwick students, they're same age students. I mean, both crazy <laughs> student sections, but uh, I'm proud to be. Uh, I felt like I can have my boys, so. Great, amazing. Congratulations on the win. Thank you, I appreciate it.